welcome to Cabsat TV for 2015, right down here in our Cabsat TV studio, uh, which has been provided by the wonderful people at Oasis. And I'm joined now by Basil from Oasis. Welcome to our studio. Well, Thank you. Welcome to your studio. Thank you. Welcome to your uh, studio too. Now, great facilities. We'll come on to those in a second. Um, we, of course, spoke last year at Cabsat as it celebrated its 20th year. Um, you look younger and younger every single year. Thank you. I get greyer and greyer every single year. But uh, seriously, uh, a lot's happened with Oasis in the Absolutely. last 12 months. Absolutely. It's a quite challenging market. Um, Dubai going towards 2020, um, the um, uh, increasing requirement for, for media, for broadcast and production, um, because of the situations in the Middle East. So there's two types of demand. There's the news type of demand and there's the production, the drama production type of demand. Uh, so obviously the, the, the past 12 years, uh, 12 months, we've been uh, very busy with various projects. Uh, the new technology also been developed, so the manufacturers, the uh, producers of the equipment, uh, the technology, the broadcast technology has been increased drastically as, as all other technologies and uh, all the, the broadcasters and the clients would like to always upgrade their gear up to the latest standards and, and so on which creates the opportunity. Uh, opportunities comes with the challenges of course like you know this in this region most of the TV production or the TV uh, broadcasters are not the commercial based uh, stations. Having said that, as I said, the increasing demand on the media, whether it's news or production, always creates an opportunity for our company and other uh, companies working in this industry to, to, uh, to enjoy the business. So I, I would say it was a uh, quite easy period for us uh, since uh, last year. Since we and on the stand this year, I mean, it's a bigger stand. You have a lot more uh, technology here and you've got some key partners as well. Absolutely, absolutely. Um, so, from last year, uh, for sure, we hosting Capsa TV within our stand, within our main stand, is a major step for us um, as a showcase, as a marketing tool, and of course, hosting the visitors and the key people of the show within our stand. Um, and of course, the, the expansion we've done with, with a number of partners required a bigger space to display certain solutions. As you can say, the unique thing on Oasis stand has always been showing a workflow system. It's not a static display of a product. Um, so probably we are the only company within the show who is displaying full uh, lighting solutions, studio lighting solutions, in addition to the camera and the production solutions in a workflow, in a working workflow solution. So we're not saying to the uh, visitors, here's a camera, here's a mixer. He's a monitor or he's an editing machine. We are showing them the complete solution from A to Z. Uh, so with the expansion of products, with the expansion of the partners, we have now all the lighting on this stand. Partially was the case last year, but this year is 100%. All lights are LED. So we have the static lights, the white lights, studio lights, and the color changing lights, the dynamic uh, lights, which is now entering and, and playing a great role in the broadcast industry either in the news or TV production uh, studios. Uh, specifically with the news, when the news are a boring stuff, you know, adding a dynamic lighting is a good uh, distraction yeah. to, to the viewers. Um, so, and we have, the, of course, the partnership with Data Video. Uh, we've, we've, we are bringing to the industry a unique virtual studio because it's not really directly um, or um, has been made for a major broadcast, has been made for cost-effective uh, TV stations, producers. Uh, we are targeting very much a YouTube channel kind of clients, plus an, uh, an education, uh, education sector of the market. Education sector and the broadcast, the media colleges has been very important for us. And we provide the turnkey, the lights, the cameras, the whole virtual studio. Resisti provides the LED lights, we have ETC on the control part of it, uh, JVC on the AMG and studio cameras, uh, Hitachi on the high-end broadcast cameras, uh, data video on all the mobile production facilities. Uh, uh, of course, we have uh, 
company partner called Drosco, which fits all the accessories required for the TV production or audio production. So it's it's a complete uh, package, complete solution uh, we are providing to the customer. The region. And it's not just broadcast. Uh, you guys it's have never many about strengths. Broadcast you, only. You, you, you many strengths to the boat. <laughs> absolutely, you? absolutely. There are actually major four business units for Oasis Enterprises projects. Uh, one of them is broadcast, of course. Uh, the second one is lighting division, and in lighting division we have also two subdivisions. We have studio lighting, and uh, I would say Oasis has always enjoyed a great market share within the studio business, studio lighting business. Uh, we've done all the major studios for all major broadcasters within the GCC region, but also we have a new division, a newborn division, newborn I would say four or five years old, which is architectural lighting division, which is targeting theme parks and projects like. The Grand Mosque in Abu Dhabi, Ferrari uh, theme park, uh, Yas Water Park, uh, Burj Khalifa, festive lighting, the one that you see on the show every yes. half an hour. And of course now with the new project with the theme parks coming to Dubai, this is now an active business uh, unit for Oasis. And then we have the Pro AV, which is targeting auditoriums, theatres, multi-purpose halls. Uh, as I said, ma mainly for an education sector, which is a major interest and focus for us uh, currently, both on broadcast and OAV. And finally we have the security and public address uh, systems. So projects like uh, PA systems in airports, CCTV business for major uh, buildings, is also a growing business in the UAE and uh, Gulf region. So the next 12 months look like are going to be very busy for you. It will be you a challenge. You will be younger <laughs> when we meet next year, I will be greyer. But what's the future got for Oasis? Um, for sure, it will be a challenging uh, few years, specifically the coming 12 months. Uh, the pipeline is great for Oasis. And here comes the challenge for us because we always focus on the, the service and the value we present. As a local, 100% local company, there's always a message. It's not, it's not only about selling, it's about uh, maintaining certain reputation and adding value to the business we are building in this region. Uh, it's family business run by uh, third generation of, of owners and they are passing to the fourth generation. Uh, so with, with the business we are always adding value and, and maintaining the value on the busy time is always a challenge. But we are uh, uh, adding people, we've, we've hired new people into our organization and uh, I think the 12th month will be quite busy for us and we are confident that we will be adding greater value to those projects we are building. We continue to pass the message to the market that there is a company here who can do our solutions with added value and emphasize on the service and offer service services. Well, the future looks bright. The future looks like Oasis. Basil, thank you for your time. Thank you.